In this video, we will enhance our details and add vignette effect. Generally, you could use two techniques to do that. First, manual techniques, and secondly, using our camera raw filter effects. Press Shift Control Alt E or Shift Command Option E on Mac. Now remove your color information. To do that, go to Image menu, Adjustments, and Desaturate, or simply press Shift Control U or Shift Command U on Mac. Now go to Filter menu, Other, and High Pass. I'm zooming a bit here. You have to see edges between any different entities. So don't increase radius too much or too low. Something like that. Two edges be a bit visible. OK. Now for blending type, we could choose between overlay or soft light. Overlay effect much stronger than soft light. I enable overlay and zooming a bit here just to show you how it's working before and after as you see our details are enhanced much more better and of course i could decrease opacity value to not be so sharp maybe something about 40 percent enough and to adding vignette effect also, we could do manually or using camera raw filter. First, I do manually. I could create a new layer, enable my brush tool, black color, make it big and soft, and start adding vignette in the corner and decrease opacity or you could fill your layer with black color press alt or option delete or go to edit menu fill with black color ok and enable razor with large soft value and start erasing and decrease opacity but personally, I prefer to use camera raw filter for add vignetting and detail enhancement. To do that, we could make copy merge again. So press Shift Control Alt E or Shift Command Option E on Mac to copy merge. Better to create a smart layer. Now go to filter menu camera raw filter here we have texture and clarity allow me to zoom to show you better check here for texture as you see details are much more visible don't add too much and clarity i think this is fine before after also you could zoom in to see what's happening here before after all right control or command zero and we have vignette effect in effects part if you move your slider to the left side you will add your vignette effect don't add too much also if you like to create your image similar to real photo shot with camera you could add some grain don't add too much and also we could add from optic section distortion as you see usually negative value and we have vignette here too I think this is fine, OK. So this is before and after. In the next video, we prepare our image for print and web standards. 